Oh, there's a little job I'm trying to do because um, this is the transformer from the keyboard and as you see one of the pins uh, snapped off so I've taken it apart just to see if I can do a, a little fix on it it's got these funny little screws on it which are specially made for a special screwdriver so they were quite hard to get out if we take this thing off we'll see the thing works like this two little springs here in there which make contact with the transformer then inside there you, go, there you can see it so what I'm gonna attempt to do is I've got an old cable here from something else from a video recorder or something I can't remember what just I always cut cables off because you you never know when you might need them like now and uh, what I intend to do is um, is just solder that onto these uh, two uh, cables here, onto these two points here, and and then where the old pins were there, if you can see that, where the pins were there. I'll just drill a hole in there and take the cable through there. So let's see if it works. And once again, I wouldn't recommend uh, following me as a professional or anything I'm just doing it to try and get this thing working hopefully I won't burn the house down but as I'm saying I'm not an electrician and I wouldn't like anyone's safety to be dependent on this video so we've drilled out this hole here and we'll just put the cable in like that through that hole and we'll strip that solder it on there see if it works so first of all we just put a bit of solder on these on these ends here. So the next thing we've got to do is just put this together and see if it works. Like I said, they've got this special safety screws to stop you mucking about on it. So it's quite hard to screw them in. So we plug it in now, see if it blows up. And if it doesn't blow up, that's all right. works. Have a quick smell of the transformer, see if it's not burning out. Everything's good. So, saved a couple of pennies and got the job done.